why not draw a line under it then and just apologise? Can you apologise to said postmasters? Of course, I regret. That's not an apology. Well, I, I've said of course. I think it really is. Well, why don't you um, say I am sorry? Well, I, I've said time and time again that I deeply regret that's not that I, I was sorry. that I was li that I was l lied to. That's not I was lied that's to right. on an industrial scale, and of course, I'm sure every other post office minister who was lied to uh, regrets that they were part of this huge conspiracy that the post office mm -hmm. perpetrated. Why can't you say sorry? Well, of course, I, I, I feel that um, I'm right to express regret for not well, getting sorry, to the bottom. Say sorry, it's the least they deserve. Look what they've been through. Just say sorry for your part in not having well, got my, to the answers. My heart goes out to the hundreds of people who were sorry. hit, and I, I deeply regret that we didn't get to the bottom of the lies that were told. Uh, and I deeply regret that it took till 2019 in the High Court case until um, people got the truth. And what we absolutely need to focus in on now is getting that compensation quickly. When you listen to the sub-postmasters, that's what they want. They want to make sure that compensation is there. And I think of my postmaster who I'm working for. Um, his case was extremely difficult. Um, when we worked with his lawyers, we were told because he had pleaded guilty, there was no chance. So we need to get the action to help people like him. Mm, one last chance to say sorry. Of, of course I regret what happened. Of course, uh, I'm no, sure no, the judges no. and I'm sure all the post office ministers deeply regret. And I hope the yeah. inquiry can get to the yeah, bottom so of those, of those people. Post don't get an apology. They don't deserve that apology. Well, the post, post office deserve a huge amount. They deserve compensation. They, they deserve a huge apology from the post office, uh, from, from Fujitsu, and from all the people who led this conspiracy of lies against them and, frankly, the whole British public. All right. Sir Ed Davey, thank you very much. Thank you.